Oh boy, I said I wasn't gonna do it anymore, but here we are. Got two more boxes for some reason. I, <laughs> I, I know the last time I opened the box, I said this would be the last time I buy every Starlight product, but got a good price on these online. Um, just ignore these prices, they're totally wrong. I bought these from a, an eBay seller. It, from the sounds of it, he owns a local store. So I'm really hoping these aren't searched. Pretty positive they aren't. They're all sealed and everything. But, uh, you know, it's possible to search a case. I don't think a local store would risk doing that, though. They seem to be a pretty big one. I'm not going to say any names. Maybe at the end of the video, if it turns out to be real bad, or in the comments or something. But I have faith in them. So, yeah. <laughs> I think at this point, this is like the... What, boxes 7 and... No, no. One, two, six and seven. I've opened five boxes already, I'm pretty sure. So this is box six and seven. <sighs> Man, if I was collecting Vice Shorts when this set came out, I'd have just, I would have just bought a case. But you know, um, this is actually, for those who don't know, the series that got me into collecting Vice Shorts in the first place. I watched this anime like a year ago. I don't know, it was a while ago. And uh, I really liked it. I, I normally don't like, I, I didn't think I would like these type of shows, but I really did. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and uh, you know, got me to collecting this. And from here, I started collecting all kinds of my shorts products, as you can tell from my channel. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty packs, and the promo. Hey, uh, this promo—it's been too long since I opened the promo, so I don't remember which ones I have and don't have already. I know I want more of the Futaba and Karuko ones, but cool promo. Twenty packs. I. Oh well. Two, five, six. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and ten. All right. So you guys see my other box openings. I'm gonna open the packs. I'll go two at a time since I have two boxes, so double speed. And uh, yeah. Whew. All right. Last time I opened some boxes, I got pretty good results. So here's open. Knock on wood. Open it two at a time. Here we go. Really want some more of the SSPs, obviously, but collecting this series pretty hard if you can't tell. Got the four commons, two uncommons. Sorry for the our own stage. Um, I like this card. I use the standby. I have a standby deck with there's a Karen and Hikari. That's like my main review deck. I don't have all the pieces for a Kaoruko Futaba one, but I do want one, so I'm pretty sure. With these boxes, I'll have enough. And the Climax Common. I know this set pretty well. I don't know the game too well, but this set for sure. Got the four commons, two uncommons. And uh, my own stage, Claudine. Climax Common. I think at this point, I have... Maybe not. I, I have almost a play set of every rare and below. I might be missing a couple of the rares. And I'm missing, obviously, I don't have play sets of the double rares yet. Not even really close, but you know, these boxes, maybe I'll get there. Then I can make a Karuko Futaba duck while still keeping my Karen duck. Three, four. Karen's my favorite character. And uh, my hero's pretty cool. Four, two, rare. And oh, best combo, standby. Uh, this was a climax common, right? Yeah, it was. Next pack, we got one, two, three, four commons. Two uncommons. It's a rare. Climax rare. Oh, this is the other card I use in my deck. Three, four. Anyway, I assume that people who are watching this are more so fans of Revy Starlight than of Vice Shorts. I think that's just the assumption I go with based on what I usually upload on this channel, but who knows. The, uh, the movie is coming out soon. The Rondo, Rondo, Rondo one. That's going to be a recap movie of the anime. I miscut this, sorry. It's going to be a, uh, what did I say? Yeah, it's a recap movie of the whole anime. It's going to have a few new scenes in it. I'm going to go into more detail on some stuff. All from Nana's point of view. So, oh, should be interesting. And then after that, they're going to make like a sequel movie. It's like an aftermath kind of thing. Four commons, two uncommons, and an SR. All right, well, that's cool. I don't, ha I don't have one of these ones yet. The bad thing about you getting an SR is that it lowers the chance of you getting an SP or higher in, in the box. But uh, I'll go over that in a second. Climax Common. 
one, two, three, four commons, two uncommons, and a rare. Oh, uh, so the towards the light one that no one uses. Climax rare though. Two, three, four. One, two. One, two, three, four. Now let's take a closer look at this SR. The foiling on this one is super nice. You can see the uh, that like boxy pattern. Yeah, alternating box. This is cool because I'm trying to collect all the foils. I mean, maybe not like the really expensive ones because that's a bit out of my price range, and I'm somewhat reasonable with my money. Not really. I say that yet about seven boxes, so clearly not. Um, yeah, I don't have this one yet. Maybe I, after this is over, I'll pull over all my SRs I have so far. Actually, I can do that now. Yeah. Uh, what do I got? Keep them in this Pokemon tin right here. Oh, actually, I guess I keep my rares in here too. I have way less rares than I thought I did. Granted, a lot, some of them are taken out of a for a deck, but still, definitely not even close to place out some of the rares. Uh, let's see. Get these double rares out of the way. Here's the SRs I have so far. Got that, that. I didn't pull all these. A few of them I bought as singles. I think maybe about half of them I bought as singles. And then the triple rares. Yeah, I bought some of them. But yeah, so... Always good to see a new SR. Very nice to add to my collection. Good look at Juna right there. The thing I like about this SR that's a totally different art than her normal, the normal uh, prim and proper card. So that's good. All right, let's keep going, shall we? I can't remember if I kept a sealed pack of this series or not for my sealed pack collection. I like to keep a couple sealed packs of every different set. Just a little kind of collector thing. Two, three, four. Oh, that's cool. You get these two back to back. <laughs> four commons, two uncommons. So double rare. First double rare of the pack. Yeah, I don't know why I put this here. First double rare of the box. It's the uh, Brainstorm Juna. So that's good. We got that climax common. Two, three, four. One, two. Oh, this is the good double. I I think I have three of them so far, so now I have a playset. This is the uh, really good double rare. This is like the best one you can pull. So nice. Climax common. One, two, three, four. One, two. One, two, three, four. One, two. Should I sleeve these up? Maybe I should. Or at least, at least this one. I'll sleeve up. Got my Pokemon sleeves right here, as always. All right, packs nine and ten. Let's go. Still got a lot of things left in this box to get. What do we got? Got one, two, three, four commons, two uncommons. Rare Nana. This is good. This is the uh, twin drive one. I really want more of these. I need it to, uh, I think I have three so far. And if I want to use a Kyrako deck and a, without dissembling my main deck, it's, it'll take like six or seven copies i think my next common one two three four one two rare oh prim, prim and proper juna okay climax common four two one four two one okay so you can see right by here the side by side comparison there's the rare version this is the um sr version i was blanking on the name right there but uh Pretty interesting to see. Yeah. All right, let's just keep going. I, I love it when you pull like SR version and then you can also pull the regular version in the same pack. So he's like, oh, okay, so there's clearly differences right there. Uh, packs 11 and 12, we're starting the second half of the first box. This is a two box opening, I'm pretty sure. I don't see why I wouldn't make them both of them in the same video. If I've done it in the past, all right. Been two, pack, two packs at a time, so it's going by faster. Starting with the Futaba Bond. One, two, three, four commons. Two uncommons and rare. One, two, three, four. One, two, and double her Karen. Okay, the, the funny thing about this is that um, in my Karen deck, I actually I only pulled three out of the five boxes I had beforehand. So before there was this local tournament, like a week and a half before, I actually bought the single of this. So now I have five, so 
you know, of something. But Karen, my favorite character, so here are you guys' favorite characters. Also, have I not pulled I've only pulled two climax rares. Wow. Did I, go, did I go through all this already? Yeah, I did. Four commons, two uncommons rare. Four commons, two uncommons, double rare. Alright, so we got three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs. There can be I forget if there's four or five double rares in each. I think there's five. I want to say there's five. I'm kind of blanking right now. I should have looked at it beforehand. But five double rares, let's assume. So you can get two more double rares and maybe a hollow if we're lucky. Hope these boxes weren't searched. We've got one, two, three, four commons, two uncommons. Oh, rare. This is the brainstorm card. This is a good one. Okay, next common. Got one, two, three, four commons, two uncommons. Rare, no other friend. Good for a card code deck. Climax common. Revue Starlight. This is the card, Revue Starlight. I wish it were better. Four, two, one. Four, two, one. Yep. All right. A lot's been happening in the mobile game lately. If you guys, I know you play the Ruby Starlight mobile game. They totally changed the whole UI. There was that Starry Diamond event that just ended. And now they're doing a first anniversary. So a lot of, uh, oh, there's a My Own Shine. I, I like these ones. They're all nice. All of My Own Shine cards. Um, and there's a first anniversary event. And there's like a comeback event. If you guys have quit the game and haven't played in a while, you come back, you get some really good gotcha pulls. Oh. You see the shine? One, two. Oh, it's another SR. Huh. Two SRs in the same pack is kind of weird. Um, I like this one because it's the backup. I run this. And this one looks a lot nicer than the default art for it. Don't think I have one of these. I'm pretty sure I don't. <laughs> I just showed you all my SRs and I'm blanking if I have it or not. I don't think so. I, I've looked at these online so much that I kind of have it mixed up which ones I have and don't have. But uh, let's take a nice look at this while I sleeve it up. It's a 2,000 backup, cost zero. This art's really nice. I feel like this is the kind they'd use on like promo material, as opposed to the one in the sh in the, the default one they used like an episode from the show, where they're doing the duo fights. I don't. I guess I didn't pull the rare. Unfortunate. I wanted to show you. But uh, four packs left, and I'm gonna go one at a time for these because I do want to keep one sealed just for collection's sake. Let's go. One, two, three, four. One, two. Rare Encore Car Nitro. Climax Rare. Four, two, one. Next. One, two, three, four. One, two. Double rare. Brave readiness, my attendo. And the climax comment. Alright, so that's four double rares. I'm pretty sure there's still one more. I think so. So 50 50 chance I can keep a sealed pack. Let's see if I'm lucky. I'll go with this one. Did I guess right? Come on. We got one, two, four commons as always, two in commons. Oh, I did guess right. Oh, that's nice. Um, this is a really good card in like pretty much every deck. Got a nice common. Extremely good in the standby deck, obviously, but still really powerful in uh, the Karuko one. And the, I, I don't know too much about the Maya Claudian one because they're like my least favorite characters in this, of the base series. I mean, I don't dislike them, but I haven't looked too far into that deck list, but five double rares. And I get my sealed pack. Uh, what am I doing? Four commons, two uncommons. All right, keeping this one sealed. So out of 19 packs, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 rares. Normally you'd get 14. I really wanted more of these. Hopefully I'll get it. 14. So 13 rares, the five double rares right here. I got the Inanna, Maya, 
the Myon Shine Karen, the other Karen, the finisher, and the Brainstorm Juno. And two SRs, so it could be worse. And they're both new ones, so that's nice. And uh guess I'll just go to the second box. Let me move these out of the way real fast. Oh man, I just opened like a hundred dollars of product. Or I'm just about to open the other half. Uh, One box down, one more to go. It's pretty funny, the, uh... oh, there's the sticker. I was wondering where the stickers went. Uh, apparently the guy that owned the, the store, he was selling these for 75 a box originally. I got it for much cheaper than that. And it was on eBay too, so I imagine he took a pretty decent loss on it. I'm sorry for you guy. But that's yes, the only reason I bought more of these. I bought so many of these and I figured I, should, I would stop, but when the price is that good, go for it, right? Oh, promo. Oh, it's not the promo I wanted. I wanted either the Mahiro promo or the Futaba Karuko promo, but, you know, more promos are always nice. What are the odds? Um, 20 packs probably, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 20 packs. All right, going two at a time again. You guys know the drill at this point. Well, you know, one thing I didn't do yet, I didn't show you guys, I mean, I probably did it in another video a long time ago, but who knows if you've even seen that one. Here's what the pack looks like close up. Looks very nice. Really good art, nice clean. I like the white and red combo. And uh, here's the back. Pause if you want to read that. I don't really want to go into it. But I used like the font for every starlight and everything you can see right there, so that's cool. Alright, first two packs. First two packs. What are we gonna get? We got the four commons, two commons, pajama party Maya, pretty worthless card to be honest. Top star combo. Three, four. Oh, I see a shine. Come on, come on. Be a good one. Two uncommons and Encore Karen. Darn. I actually have one of these already. Well, that's disappointing. Because again, that means that it's less likely that you're going to get a hit in the future. But let's take a look at it anyway. It's nice. Um, the card itself is pretty bad. So I don't really think it sees much use, but the art's really nice. I already mentioned Karen's like my favorite character, so pretty cool, I guess. All right, parent. Next two. Oh, I pulled three. Packs three and four. Can't risk using these pull tabs. Don't want to bend the cards. So using scissors for every pack. All right. What do we got? Seems like a lot of packs start with her. Two, three, four, one, two. All right, rare. Uh, I really like this card in the deck. It's only like a one of though, or if anything, so. Oh well, climax rare. Three, four, one, two, double rare. All right, cool. I definitely don't have four of these. So that's pretty nice. Three, four, again, I really want the Kauruko and Futaba ones, so. I don't think I've gotten either of those yet. What did I get in the last one? Yeah, I didn't get either of those in the last one. Shoot. Can I actually not build a tire coat for top of after all? It's really helping. I guess I could always buy more singles, but then if I end up just buying more boxes, I'd be like, oh, why'd I buy these singles for in the future, you know? Right, one, two, three, four, one, two. This one again. Climax is coming. Two, three, four, one, two. Wow, SR. Okay, well, that sucks. I have this one already, but I'll go over it again real fast. Four, two, one, one, four, two. Okay, disappointing box. I wonder if that guy did search these. No. Oh. No, it could just be bad luck. But I have this already. It is nice. But 
I already have it, so whatever. There's the two of them. Oh man. So you can search cases because each case has only a certain amount of SPs, SSPs, etc., etc. in it. So you just find the boxes that have those, and then that's it. You just sell the rest like that one guy might have done. That's why buying on eBay especially is kind of a risk. You never know, and there's really no proof. Usually, if the guy owns a store, it's less likely because the reputation is on the line, but I don't know. I've definitely been burned by some online sellers before with like... I think one guy I bought five, five booster boxes from. I got no SPs or anything. So, looks likely. But I'm not going to talk about that now. Let's just keep opening. Rare. Climax rare. Double rare. All right. One, two, three, four. One, two. Four. One, two. All right, we're... After this, we'll be half done with the second box. I've already gotten two hollows, so a bit disappointing. Now I'm just really hoping for the Futaba and Karuko double rares. Come on, come on. Three, four, one, two. Uh, two become one. Oh, this is the card I got the. I'll show you that in a second. Climax rare. One, two, three, four, one, two. Oh, hey, there's one of them, Futaba. Now I just gotta get the Karuko and Climax Con. Common, climax rare, common, uncommon, rare. Okay, so this is the backup rare. And in the last box, I got the SR version. So you can kind of see this one is like way, way nicer than this art. Way nicer. Yep. All right, half done. Come on, Kawuko. Come on. Or, I, I mean, I'd always take another My Own Shine Karen, cause, just because that's like the best card you can pull. Even though I play, have a playset at this point. I'll stretch hand Karen. Climax. Four. One, two. Rare Futaba. That's pretty good. Ow, oh, now I think about it. I've pulled very few of these, and the Karako are just rares. Wow. Hmm. Something to think about. I forget that this set has alarms, because all the alarms are so bad. Alarms are a card mechanic for if you play the game. And if you're not playing and you just like looking at all the review stuff, then you're where I was a few months ago. Right. For top of Bond. Two, three, four, two, two. Rare Mountain Shine. One, two, three, four. One, two. Rare Mountain Shine. Nice. That's a good one. Climax. Two, three, four. Come on. Got this pack opening down. Going pretty fast. Four commons, two uncommons, and <laughs> that's the uh, toward the light one. Prime X. Two, three, four, one, two. Rare, good at cooking, not it. Prime X, right? Four, two, one, one, four, two, one. There we go. Down to four packs left. Maybe I'll start opening one at a time for the suspense. Always starts with her. All the packs start with her. One, two, three, four. One, two. Double rare Mahiru Bomb. That's not a Kauruko. Not a Kauruko at all. Right. One, two, three, four. One, two. It's another Nana. All right, so there's all the hits. Climax combo. Um, so we got five double rares. These are just gonna be rares, so I'm not even gonna bother opening them, you know. 
keep it sealed and all that. Um, here's the rares I got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Rares. Double rares. We got no Kairuko, but you got the Futaba, Nana, Mahiru, uh, Squadin, and Hikari. And these. It's not the best boxes, but I guess it could have been worse. Um, I forget if you're guaranteed two SRs or higher, or if you're, you might get only one foil, but it's possible that these boxes were searched. Um, let me know what you guys think. Could just be that I'm unlucky, but buying on eBay, always a red flag. Old sets especially, another red flag. Um, yep, let me know what you guys think. Any comments, questions, whatever, in the comments. Um, keep an eye out for my next video. I actually got more than just these from the eBay guy, but I won't open them right now. Save them for another day. See ya.